So we can multiply on a number line. So if we have 5 times 3, we can count in steps of 3 5 times. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15. So we've added 3 5 times, and that gives us 15. Now with 3 times 5, we can count in steps of 5 3 times. So 5, 10, 15. So whether we do 5 times 3 or 3 times 5, we get to 15. And this is sometimes called the commutative property of multiplication. Order doesn't matter. Whichever way you multiply the numbers, you'll get the same answer. So let's look at 7 times 4 and 4 times 7. We can count in steps of 4 7 times. 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, 24, 28. Or, counting in steps of 7 4 times, we have 7, another 7 gives us 14, add another 7 to 14 and we have 21, and our fourth 7 takes us to 28. So if you didn't know your 7 times table, you could still answer 4 times 7, because you know that with multiplication, order doesn't matter, and 7 times 4 will give you the same answer.